Well, hello everybody. Welcome back. It's Aaron. Today is my birthday. And last night, we may have had a bit of a storm. When I say may have, I mean definitely. Definitely. When I say a bit of a storm, I mean it might as well have been a tornado. You can see behind me. It's a mess. That is one of the reasons why the Bradford pear is the worst tree ever. I know why they put them in, but um, they are, they just suck. <laughs> That's <laughs> plain and simple. We've got three of them right here and I was gonna cut them down. I decided to wait until after the, the summer so you know, they would continue to shade the back porch. Well, that one behind me kind of took care of itself. So, on my way to work this morning, there was, well, there were multiple limbs in the driveway that I had to get out and move so I could get out of the driveway to go to work. So I thought I would do a little walkabout and just see like what's happening. I need to walk the fence line anyway. I'm going to do that on my own. Um, tomorrow is big junk pickup. We live uh, close enough to Oklahoma City that we get their trash service. And they do a big junk pickup once a month. So my leftover fencing stuff is going to go out today anyway. If I get any of the limbs cleaned up, they might go out too. Especially the stuff that I can't burn in the fireplace. And I thought we'd just take a little look around and um, see what happened. The sheep have been loving the leaf buffet, the llamas too. I did not know that. Uh, the first time we let them out of their pen over here, they went straight to the branches that I had left on the ground uh, from when I was cleaning up the fence line when we put in the fence. So um, let me get through some of these gates and we'll, we'll see... We'll see the aftermath. Here come all my friends. Hi, Blue. Hey, Ra Ra. Hi. Hi, girls. And there's a she bangs. She won't let me. She won't let me pet her. So this tree actually split. Ah. Oh my God! I'm not going to be able to talk, am I? This tree actually split right about the time where we bought the house. You could see right there. And it happened again. And everyone's been eating that all day today. My bench swing got knocked over and broken. Well, that sucks. Hi, Arthur. Uh, now I'm in for it. I love you. Stop chasing me. So I've got a lot of smaller limbs. That's not really that big of a deal, I guess. Most of this is usually dirt right here. It was just leaves when we moved in, trying to get the grass to spread. So this tree is having it pretty rough. That's probably like the fourth or fifth big limb that's fallen off of that one. Got a little llama family over here.
Hi, Liam. I'm glad you survived the storm. What's up, buddy? Hi. You're very interested in the camera. I don't even know where this one came from. This was across the driveway. There's not another tree w within 30 feet of this thing. And it's heavier than it looks. That's going to be a fun one. That one looked mostly dead anyway. That is next year's firewood is what that is. Well, it looks like our really big trees are still there. That's good. That one, not so much. So my cow neighbor called me earlier and asked me to make sure our gate was shut over there. Our 15 acres back here uh, borders, well, the whole north side borders his property. And that's his cow pasture. And that is a big tree that apparently got totally uprooted and fell on the fence. I don't think I can get over the fence. I'd like to see it from the, the bottom side. I think it'd be a really cool picture and or video, but I don't, I don't really want to jump barbed wire right now. Besides, I've got work to do over there. Uh, if he calls me, I'll probably bring the chainsaw over and cut whatever needs to be cut on my side of the fence here, but I've got a, uh, quite a bit of my own cleaning up to do so I'm gonna leave it there if you're around these parts I hope uh, hope you made it through this thing unscathed very uncharacteristic for this time of year but you know global climate change and all that you never know what could happen so um, I'm gonna go do some work and eat a totally ordinary birthday dinner Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you next time.